Hello everyone and welcome to another video tutorial. My name is Ken, also known as Wiltshire, and today I'll be showing you guys how to change your log on screen's background on Windows 7. Let's hop over to my PC's desktop so I can show you guys how to change your background. Okay, now that I'm over to my PC's desktop, the first thing that you would want to do is want to go into the description below and download the linked file. The file is a zip folder called Win7 Log On Background Changer. Now once you've downloaded that, we want to open up the zip folder that you downloaded. And the next thing we want to do is we want to extract the contents of the zip folder. We can do this by dragging this file over to our desktop. And now that we have extracted the file, we want to open up the folder. And we are greeted with five files. Now the one that you want to open is the Win7 Logon Background Changer. Now, this is the best thing about this program. It comes in two different languages, English and French. If you're French speaking, open up the FR folder up there. If you're English, just open up the application that's already given to you. So the first thing you want to do before opening the application is right click and run this as administrator. If you don't do this, it may not work properly. So as you can see, we are greeted by a graphical user interface. Now, the next thing you want to do is you want to find the picture that you want as your log on screen background. We can do this by pressing the choose folder button and since mine's on my desktop I'm going to select desktop and it will load all the images that are on your desktop. Now I'm going to choose this image and you'll hear a nice little sound there and it'll show you an example of what the background is going to look like. Now the next thing you want to do is you want to click the apply button and it will say please wait the paper is being applied and it shouldn't take too long and now it will come up with some information. Click yes again to ensure that it's applied the wallpaper correctly. Now it may pop up again because there's a bug in this program but if you click no the next time you're perfectly fine. Now I'm going to switch over to my camera because it's really hard to record your your log off screen without having software open. <laughs> so I'll see you guys then. Okay, now I switch over to my camcorder. Instead of my PC capturing software, I'm going to log off my computer to show you guys that the background that I chose to have as the log on background screen has actually been applied. As you can see there, the background is now there instead of the original one. And I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you really liked it, please thumbs up the video or favorite. That would be greatly appreciated. And remember, if it's easy to follow, it's easy to learn. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I'll see you guys later.